Hey fellas, today we're going to be looking at two applications for Windows Phone. The first one being uh, Instance, formerly known as It's Digram, which is the third-party Instagram client for Windows Phone. As you can see, the main feed here works just like the other Instagram applications. And a simple uh, double tap on a photo will get you a like. You can leave a comment by tapping on the photo and leaving a comment here. Um, you can also save and share photos, which is a neat feature. The um, popular feed is still here. Um, there's a quick uh, link to your profile right here, um, which seems to be per working pretty well. Uh, in their most recent update, they fixed the Find Friends feature, which now actually works, and it loads your contacts um, to follow. Uh, and there's some general settings here. Um, here you have background updates. You can link to your Facebook and Twitter accounts to post automatically. And that, um, and let's see here, let's get an example of um, a picture here. Let's take a quick picture of this lovely chair. Alright, now you hit accept and you have select, which is nice, you can select the region of the photo you want. Um, and you have many filters here, let's see, you have, um, well, you have, and there's, a, there's an area to download the newest filters too. That's another one part of the uh, settings you can access. So let's select Jack because it looks cool and retro. I guess that's the term. And then you hit done. You can toggle between Facebook and Twitter, add your caption. Um, there's some shortcuts down here for that. And you are good to go. And it posts immediately, unlike uh, Instagram and um, other applications that take a while. So that is Instance. And here we have Snapchat or Swapchat. This is third party client is called, as you can see there, Swapchat. Uh, essentially, it's just like Snapchat. You just. Um, take a picture and send it on its way. Uh, it currently does have some limitations though. Um, let's see, for example, I don't believe you can adjust, see there, it just crashed. Um, I do believe you cannot adjust the picture, how long, how long it takes. And maybe you can't do videos either, but you can send captions, and you can set a time, and you can send it to all your friends. You also have an inbox here that works for receiving. You have another crash. It's in the early beta, by the way, so very early stages of development. Um, but here you have messages here. You can view them, tap and hold the view. You can even pin it to start, which is a cool feature. So yeah, there you go. Those are the two cool third-party applications that are available for Windows Phone.